Born in 1974, the actor we're discussing began their journey in the world of entertainment at a young age. They first appeared on screen in the early 1990s, quickly gaining recognition for their raw talent and dedication. The actor's breakout role came in 1995 when they starred in the critically acclaimed film The Brady Bunch Movie. Their portrayal of the quirky and lovable Jeffrey was a standout performance that helped establish their career in Hollywood. From there, the actor went on to appear in a number of successful films, including Saving Private Ryan, Lost in Translation, and Avatar. They also had a memorable role in the hit TV show Friends, where they played Phoebe's brother, Frank Jr. Despite their success in film and television, the actor has never been one to rest on their laurels. They have continued to challenge themselves by taking on a wide range of roles and pushing the boundaries of their craft. In recent years, the actor has turned their attention to producing and directing, further showcasing their versatility and creativity. Their work behind the camera is just as impressive as their work in front of it, and they have become a respected and admired figure in the industry. Throughout their career, the actor has remained humble and dedicated to their craft. They continue to inspire and captivate audiences with their powerful performances and unwavering commitment to their art. Actor Giovanni Ribisi has been entertaining audiences for decades, appearing in numerous films and TV shows. You might know him from Saving Private Ryan, Avatar, or Sneaky Pete. Do you have a favorite performance of his? Maybe it's a particular moment from one of his works that has stayed with you. We'd love to hear about it in the comments below. Perhaps you have a cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic star. Please share your stories with us. There are many fun, shocking, and sad facts coming up about the actor, so keep watching this video. For instance, did you know that the actor's first acting role was at the age of two in a commercial? Or that he changed his name from Lucariello to Rivasi to honor his grandmother? These are just a few of the interesting stories we'll be sharing about the actor's life and career. So, stay tuned. Raised in Los Angeles, the actor, born in 1974's Giovanni Ribisi, had a unique upbringing. His parents, both members of the Church of Scientology, exposed him to the film industry through their jobs as talent managers. This early exposure to the world of entertainment sparked his interest in acting. The actor's older sister, Marissa Ribisi, is also an actress, and their family frequently hosted dinner parties with celebrities, providing the young Ribisi with a glimpse into the lives of successful actors. These experiences further fueled his passion for the craft. In his teenage years, Ribisi began acting in small roles, eventually landing a part in the show The Wonder Years in 1990. This early success gave him the confidence and experience to pursue a career in acting. Throughout his career, Ribisi has worked with many notable actors and directors, citing actors such as Robert De Niro and Al Pacino as influences. He has also worked with directors such as Martin Scorsese and David Lynch, who have helped shape his approach to acting. Ribisi has spoken about the impact that these experiences and mentors have had on his career, stating that he has learned something new from each project he has worked on. His dedication to his craft and willingness to learn from others have made him a respected and successful actor in the industry. The actor, known for his work in both film and television, made his debut in 1991 at the age of 17. He quickly gained recognition for his role in the popular show The X-Files, which aired from 1996 to 22. His portrayal of the character brought a unique energy to the show and helped to solidify its success. In addition to his work on television, the actor has also made significant contributions to the film industry. He has appeared in a number of notable films, including Saving Private Ryan, The Mod Squad, and Avatar. His ability to take on a wide range of roles, from dramatic to comedic, has made him a valuable asset to any production. The actor's influence on the industry extends beyond his own performances. He has also been a producer, using his creative vision to bring new projects to life. His production company, which he founded in 2005, has produced a number of films and television shows, providing opportunities for other artists to showcase their talents. In short, the actor has made a significant impact on the film industry, both through his own performances and through his work as a producer. His contributions have helped to shape the industry and will continue to be felt for years to come. From a young age, the actor was captivated by the world of entertainment. His sister, Marissa Ribisi, introduced him to this enchanting realm when she brought him to the set of the show The Equalizer. 
This pivotal experience ignited a spark within him, and he knew then that he wanted to be a part of the magic of storytelling. Born on December 17, 1974, in Los Angeles, California, the actor's passion for acting only grew stronger as he got older. He started his career as a child actor, appearing in various commercials and television shows. However, it was his role in the film The Candyman that truly solidified his desire to pursue acting as a career. During the filming of The Candyman, the actor was deeply moved by the artistry and dedication of the cast and crew. He marveled at how they brought the story to life, and he wanted to be a part of that creative process. From that moment on, he dedicated himself to honing his craft and pursuing his passion for acting. The actor's dedication and hard work paid off, and he soon found himself appearing in numerous films and television shows. His versatile acting skills allowed him to take on a wide range of roles, showcasing his ability to transform into any character he played. Despite his success, the actor remains humble and grounded. He continues to push himself creatively, always seeking new challenges and opportunities to grow as an artist. His passion for acting is as strong as ever, and he remains committed to telling compelling stories that resonate with audiences. In Steven Spielberg's Saving Private Ryan, the actor played the role of T alongside Adam Goldberg, who had previously appeared in Days and Confused. Interestingly, Goldberg isn't the only connection between Days and Confused and the actor. Marissa Ritesi, the twin sister of the actor, also appeared in the same film. Beyond their acting careers, the actor and Marissa are active Scientologists. The actor's heritage is also noteworthy, as his paternal grandfather was of Italian origin, and he has other ancestry that includes German and English. The actor's diverse background has undoubtedly contributed to his ability to take on a wide range of roles throughout his career. In Saving Private Ryan, he demonstrated his versatility as an actor, delivering a powerful and memorable performance. The actor, born in 1974, faced financial struggles early in his career. With limited resources, he found creative solutions to overcome this hurdle. The actor once revealed that he had to live in his car during his initial days in Hollywood. Despite such hardships, he never lost sight of his dreams. Skepticism from the industry was another obstacle the actor had to face. His unique acting style was often met with resistance, but he remained undeterred. Instead of conforming to the norm, the actor chose to stay true to his craft, which eventually paid off. The actor's resilience and determination are truly inspiring. He turned his financial struggles into a motivational force, using it to fuel his passion for acting. His ability to remain authentic in the face of industry skepticism is a testament to his unwavering commitment to his craft. In the end, the actor's perseverance and creative solutions to the challenges he faced have made him a respected figure in the industry. His story serves as a reminder that success is not always a smooth journey, but with determination and resilience, one can overcome any obstacle. After receiving critical acclaim for his role in the film Saving Private Ryan, the actor graced the cover of Vanity Fair. He is best known for his recurring role as Lisa Kudrow's half-brother on the popular TV show Friends. His performance in Saving Private Ryan has been recognized for its cultural, historical, and aesthetic significance by the Library of Congress, which selected the film for the National Film Registry. After minor roles in various TV shows and films, the actor's breakthrough moment came with the 1998 film Saving Private Ryan. His portrayal of a fearful soldier, Corporal Le Pam, was widely recognized. Critics praised his ability to convey the character's internal struggle, which added depth to the ensemble cast. In 2000, the actor showcased his versatility in the comedy drama The Gift, where he played a troubled young man with a dark past. His performance was lauded for its intensity and nuance, with critics noting his ability to make the character both sympathetic and unsettling. The following year, the actor delivered another standout performance in Boiler Room. As a slick, morally ambiguous stockbroker, he embodied the film's exploration of greed and ambition. His portrayal was highly praised, with critics highlighting his charisma and commanding presence. In 2011, the actor took on a challenging role in the psychological drama, The Rum Diary, based on Hunter S. Thompson's novel. His portrayal of a manipulative, an unpredictable character was met with critical acclaim, with many praising his ability to bring complexity and depth to the role. Throughout his career, the actor has continued to challenge himself with diverse and demanding roles. 
His body of work is a testament to his talent and versatility, earning him recognition as a respected and accomplished actor in the industry. The actor has been an active Scientologist and participated in the gala opening of Scientology's Psychiatry and Industry of Death Museum in December 2005. His daughter, Lucia, born in December 1997, is named after the doomed heroine in the Dynasty Opera. Lucia's mother is the actor's ex-wife, Mariah O'Brien. In February 2002, the actor attended the Berlin Film Festival. His dedication to his craft and involvement in various projects, including both film and television, is a testament to his commitment as an artist. The actor is known for his immersive approach to roles, often delving deep into the character's psyche to deliver a convincing performance. He once mentioned in an interview that he prefers to live the character rather than act it out. This unique method allows him to organically portray complex emotions and nuances, making his performances truly captivating. His personal experiences and worldview often seep into his work, adding depth and authenticity to his characters. For instance, in one of his films, the actor drew from his own background to portray a character dealing with family issues, lending a sense of realism to the performance. In his artistic process, the actor often engages in extensive research and preparation. He has been known to meet with professionals in the field related to his character, observe their behavior, and even adopt their mannerisms. This dedication to his craft is evident in the rich and layered performances he delivers. Moreover, the actor is not afraid to take on challenging roles that push him out of his comfort zone. He has played a wide range of characters, from a troubled teenager to a tech genius, showcasing his versatility as an actor. This willingness to experiment and take risks has contributed to his enduring impact in the film industry. In essence, the actor's unique approach to his work, his immersive method, and his dedication to research and preparation, combined with his willingness to take on challenging roles, have made him a standout figure in the film industry. His ability to infuse his characters with depth and authenticity, drawing from his personal experiences and worldview, has resulted in captivating performances that resonate with audiences. The actor was born into a family of performers, with his mother, Gay Ribisi, being a manager for talent, and his father, Albert Anthony Ribisi, a musician. He has an older sister, Gina Ribisi, who is also an actress, and a twin sister, Marissa Ribisi, who is an actress and a fashion designer. The actor is 15 minutes older than Marissa. In the film Hero Wanted, the actor was approached to play the role of Lynch McGraw, but turned it down. The role eventually went to the late Stephen Kozlowski. It's not uncommon for actors to turn down roles, but it's interesting to consider what direction the film might have taken with the actor in that part. The actor, known for his versatility, made an early impact in the film Saving Private Ryan in 1998. His portrayal of a soldier struggling with the horrors of war showcased his ability to embody complex characters. Critics and industry peers took notice of his raw talent. In the early 2000s, the actor showcased his range in the critically acclaimed series Entourage, where he played a high-powered agent. His performance was praised for its nuance and authenticity, elevating the show's overall quality. The actor's influence extends beyond his own roles. As a member of the cast of Avatar, he contributed to the film's groundbreaking visual effects and storytelling techniques. The film's success has since inspired a new generation of filmmakers to push the boundaries of technology and storytelling. According to industry expert James Cameron, Giovanni's ability to bring depth and humanity to his characters has left an indelible mark on the industry. The actor's influence can also be seen in the work of those he has inspired. Actor and collaborator Jeremy Piven shares, Giovanni's commitment to his craft has always been an inspiration to me. He has a unique ability to disappear into his roles, making a lasting impact on audiences. In recent years, the actor has continued to challenge himself with diverse roles in both film and television. His contributions to the industry serve as a testament to his enduring impact and influence on the world of entertainment. The actor has a long history of education, with a focus on computer graphics. This interest led him to partner with Stereo D during the production of Avatar, a company that converts 2D images into stereoscopic 3D. Unbeknownst to James Cameron, the actor played a key role in helping Stereo D win bids to work on some of Avatar's 3D post-conversion. 
Since then, Stereo D has been responsible for the 3D post conversion of many popular films, including Titanic, Jurassic Park, The Avengers, and Star Trek Into Darkness. In addition to his work in the film industry, the actor is also connected to the musical world. He is the brother-in-law of Beck and Channing Hansenator despite his accomplishments. The actor has not been without controversy. During the filming of Basic, he clashed with filmmakers over the inclusion of a female special forces operative. At the time, women were not eligible for combat in the US military, and the actor felt that this compromised the integrity of the story. In conclusion, the actor has made a name for himself in both the film and computer graphics industries, and is also connected to the world of music. However, his career has not been without controversy. The actor, Giovanni Ribisi, leads a private life outside of the film industry. He is known for his passion for music and has even played the drums for the band, Panic at the Disco. Ribisi's love for music often finds its way into his work, as he has played music-oriented roles in various films. Family is also important to Ribisi. He has a twin sister, Marissa, who is also an actress, and they have a close bond. The actor is a devoted father to his daughter, and family values often inform his choices, both personally and professionally. Ribisi is also passionate about philanthropy and has been involved in several charitable causes. He has supported the Natural Resources Defense Council, an organization that works to protect the environment and public health. Ribisi has also been involved in various animal welfare causes and has used his platform to raise awareness for these issues. The actor's personal values and interests often inform his work. For instance, he has played roles in films that tackle social and environmental issues, reflecting his concern for these matters. Ribisi's dedication to his family, music, and philanthropy highlights his well-rounded personality and his commitment to making a positive impact in the world. The actor first appeared on the small screen in an uncredited role in the hit TV show Friends in 1995. He played the part of a man who had accidentally dropped a condom into Phoebe's guitar case while she was performing at Central Perk. The following year, he reprised his role, but this time as a recurring character named Frank Buffet Jr., Phoebe's younger half-brother. Growing up, the actor had a pet Dachshund named Lowrider, which no doubt provided him with some early companionship and comfort. In terms of his acting education, the actor studied at the Beverly Hills Playhouse with Milton Katsellas. Under Katsella's guidance, he honed his craft and developed the skills necessary to succeed in the competitive world of acting. Despite his success on screen, the actor remains a private individual who prefers to let his work speak for itself. He continues to take on diverse and challenging roles, showcasing his versatility and talent as a performer. The actor, known for their work in both film and television, has built a solid reputation in the industry. With notable performances in shows like Sneaky Pete and movies such as Avatar, their career has been marked by versatility and dedication. When reflecting on their legacy, the actor shared that they take the most pride in the opportunities they've had to bring unique characters to life and tell compelling stories. They've always strived to choose roles that challenge them and allow them to grow as an artist. As for the future, the actor is excited about the endless possibilities that the entertainment industry holds. They hope to continue to be a part of projects that inspire and entertain audiences and to work with talented individuals who share their passion for storytelling. Their advice for aspiring professionals in the field is to stay true to themselves and never stop learning. The actor emphasizes the importance of taking risks and being open to new experiences. They believe that success in the industry is not just about talent, but also about hard work, determination, and a willingness to adapt to change. In the end, the actor's legacy and future contributions will undoubtedly be marked by their unwavering commitment to their craft and their ability to captivate audiences with their powerful performances. In 1999, the actor was honored with the Showist Newcomer of the Year Award, highlighting his rising status in the film industry. One of his notable roles was in the film That Thing You Do, where he played the character of Chet. Interestingly, he shared the screen with Tom Everett Scott four years later in the film Boiler Room. When it comes to dining preferences, the actor is known to frequent the Los Feliz restaurant Little Dom's. This local hotspot is also a favorite among other celebrities such as Sandra O, oh, Hannah Tell, Michael Cera, Drew Barrymore, Bo Barrett, and Katherine Heigl. The actor's role in That Thing You Do is particularly memorable 
as it marked the beginning of a professional relationship with Tom Everett Scott, who he would later work with in Boiler Room. This just goes to show that the film industry is a small world, and connections made on set can lead to future collaborations. As for his dining habits, it's no surprise that the actor enjoys the cozy atmosphere and delicious Italian cuisine at Little Dom's. With a diverse group of celebrities also frequenting the establishment, it's clear that this restaurant is a popular spot for those in the limelight. After being born in 1974, the actor's passion for storytelling became evident at a young age. With a natural talent for immersing himself in diverse roles, he quickly made a name for himself in the entertainment industry. From his early work in popular shows like The X-Files to his memorable performance in Saving Private Ryan, the actor consistently delivered captivating and nuanced portrayals. His dedication to his craft extends beyond acting as he has explored various aspects of filmmaking, including producing and writing. This versatility has allowed him to leave his mark on numerous projects, showcasing his enduring impact on the industry. In the film Lost in Translation, the actor's portrayal of a quirky character resonated with audiences, highlighting his ability to bring depth and intrigue to any role. Through his work, he has transcended the boundaries of conventional storytelling and inspired fellow artists to step in and explore their own creativity. The actor's journey serves as a powerful reminder of the importance of perseverance and passion in the face of adversity. His ability to adapt and innovate has led to an impressive body of work that continues to captivate audiences worldwide. The power of creativity, as demonstrated by this actor, has the potential to leave a lasting impact on the entertainment industry and beyond. Initially, the actor made a mark with his presence in several films that reached the pinnacle of recognition, being nominated for the Best Picture Oscar. His role spanned from the intense battlefields of Saving Private Ryan to the alien landscapes of Avatar and its sequel. Known for his youthful appearance, he consistently delivers performances that leave a lasting impression, often portraying characters with a deep and serious nature. His ability to adapt to various roles is evident in the diverse projects he chooses. Early in his career, he even showcased his competitive spirit on a family game, show alongside his sister, demonstrating a lighter side to his persona. The actor's journey reflects a dedication to his craft, with each role adding to a career that continues to evolve. In May 2009, the actor attended the 62nd annual Cannes Film Festival in France. This prestigious event brought together filmmakers, actors, and industry professionals from around the globe to celebrate and recognize outstanding achievements in cinema. The actor's presence at the festival highlighted his ongoing commitment to the world of film and his dedication to his craft. This high-profile appearance showcased the actor's ability to captivate audiences and leave a lasting impression, further solidifying his status as a respected figure in the industry. The actor's work has transcended boundaries and resonated with fans worldwide, making him a familiar face at international film festivals. His presence at the Cannes Film Festival was a testament to his enduring impact on the film industry and his ability to continually engage audiences with his compelling performances. The actor's career has been marked by a string of successful films, each one contributing to his ever-growing legacy. His work has left an indelible mark on the film landscape, and his appearances at events like the Cannes Film Festival serve as a reminder of his continued influence and appeal. The actor, known for his versatile roles, has faced his share of personal struggles. In 2007, his sister, Gina Ribisi, passed away due to natural causes at the young age of 46. This tragic event had a profound impact on the actor, as they were very close. Gina was not only his sister, but also his manager and close confidante. Her death was a significant loss for the actor, both personally and professionally. Despite this tragedy, the actor has continued to work in the film and television industry, delivering compelling performances that showcase his range and talent. The actor's ability to immerse himself in his roles and bring complex characters to life has earned him critical acclaim and a loyal fan base. From his early work in the 90s to his more recent projects, the actor has proven himself to be a talented and dedicated performer. Throughout his career, the actor has taken on a variety of challenging roles, showcasing his versatility and range as a performer. From playing a troubled teenager in The Other Sister to a genius hacker in Sneakers, the actor has demonstrated his ability to inhabit a wide range of characters. Despite the challenges he has faced in his personal life, 
the actor remains committed to his craft and continues to push himself as a performer. His talent and dedication have earned him a place among the most respected and admired actors in the industry. In the end, the actor's career is a testament to his resilience and determination. Despite facing personal tragedy and industry challenges, he has remained focused on his craft and delivered consistently strong performances. His contributions to the world of film and television are sure to endure for years to come. After watching the actor's impressive body of work, one might wonder, what are your thoughts on the actor's contributions to the film industry? From his early roles in television shows like The X-Files to his memorable performance in Saving Private Ryan, the actor has left an indelible mark on the entertainment landscape. His ability to embody a wide range of characters has captivated audiences and earned him critical acclaim. In Avatar, he brought to life a complex character that resonated with viewers around the world. Similarly, in Selma, his portrayal of a civil rights activist added depth and nuance to the film. The actor's work in independent films should not be overlooked. In Lost in Translation, he delivered a subtle and moving performance that added to the film's rich tapestry. His ability to portray both leading and supporting roles with equal skill is a testament to his versatility as an actor. As you reflect on the actor's legacy, consider the impact he has had on the film industry and on audiences worldwide. Whether you have a favorite performance or a memorable scene, we would love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this content, please like and share it with your friend and family. And don't forget to subscribe for more celebrations of the creative spirits shaping entertainment.